And them damn my uh, them damn lights on that top of that monster that creature's head scared the shit out of me for a moment. Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Panicking, and we are back with some more No Man's Sky. Last week, when we were here, we were going around scavenging some ships. Probably we'll continue to do the same thing, mostly in this video, just trying to find some better information, some better technology to upgrade not only our ships, but ourselves as well. Hoping maybe we get lucky and we find a interceptor ship, or maybe just find something else that really stands out and makes a difference. Now we haven't been doing what most people do is and that's run straight to the galactic core or the center of the universe. We've been just kind of sticking around where we're at, checking the various systems. From what I'm seeing, not a lot of people have been in this area from where I'm at, where I'm at. I will apologize today if I seem a little off. I've not been feeling too well the past couple of days and I had to push myself to record this. It is five o'clock in the morning. Please bear with me. I'm really off my schedule and still not 100%. And here we are, the last location we were at. This is a spot that we had found when we were just kind of traversing this planetary system. I think I've gotten everything out of it already. Yeah, we did, we did. All right. Looks like there's another one back here behind us. I'm not too sure about this place. Wonder what that is right over there. Let's go check it out. So it's pretty much, what, behind and to the left of us. Don't remember if we came here last time or not, but we are going to check. Well, I said we are. I believe we have checked this out already. But we'll look, make sure. I don't want to leave anything undone or anything of that nature. It looks like we have been here because all the containers are open. Yeah, I believe we have been in here. Yeah, we have. Okay. Just wanted to make sure that we've done what we were supposed to do here. I am seeing this red. That must be something on the map itself. Let's look at our discoveries. It's a fungal mold. So we're, okay, okay, okay. I do remember looking at this before. <laughs> so let's jump in our ship now and let's see what we've got left to go off of. We have planetary chart, distress signal, upgrade, settlement charts, secure points of interest, habitable outpost, art, ancient artifacts, sentinel pillar, and ruined site. Let's see what it gives us on the distress signal. Let's see if it's going to be off planet or on planet. And let's see where it's taking us. It looks like it might be off planet. You pass this big boulder here without hitting it. Looks like it actually might be on planet. So let's go up in space just a little bit. You know, we can travel a little bit faster when we're in the outer atmosphere of the planet. There we go. That would have taken us a long time to get across that planetary side and without going into the atmosphere. See if there's anything around us. I'm not seeing any villages or anything pop up. Just, just this distress beacon. External toxicity is pretty high. All right. Rotting fruit, gentle behavior, okay. Oh, this kind of looks like our ship in a way. We might have to keep this one, that's that's pretty nice. And it looks like ours. Put that on the starship. Got a geck relic out of that. Navigation data, condensed carbon. Let's get this damaged machinery out the way. A lot of things on the ship that we're gonna have to get rid of. Net. Okay. This is the distress beacon. Dead pilot once belonged to one of the race's more affluent families. In case there's a mild mid flight demise, unclear. But the ship is likely to be carrying a decent cargo. Draped over a large box covered in dangerous looking alien markings, a strange black mist surrounds the area. Hmm. Let's open the box. 
As I open a box, a dark energy channels through me like poison. The tech I find within the container has become has come at a call. Oh Jesus. Conflict scanner. A walker brain. Okay, so we need a walker brain. That's something a little bit different. Okay, gotta find a walker brain. Let's see what's up with this ship. It is a class B. Damage potential, hyperdrive. Okay. Let's compare. This is ours currently right now. This is the new one that we've just found. They're about the same in as far as uh, holdings, um, cargo, but this one costs a little bit more, both class Bs. I'm gonna claim it, so that'll send our other ship eventually back to the uh, main, our, our freighter capital. So some of the stuff we can go ahead and knock out real quick, which we will. Gotta have three microprocessors, a little bit of more sodium nitrate for the deflector shield, ferrite, pirate lighting resonator, modification on the deflector shield, bypassing nearly every galactic standard for workmanship and safety. This upgrade module affects shield strength. So, hermetic seal and plating. Can we do those? Hermetic seal and plating. We'll get both of these going. Uh, this is the hyperdrive. We might want to go ahead and get that because there's no... What do we need? There's no telling how many, like three microprocessors. There's no telling how far we'll have to travel. And we need carbon nanotubes to do this. So one, two, three, two, one. What are we missing? What component are we missing? Chromatic metal. Okay. So we are missing chromatic metal, which I think we do have. We can easily uh, get going here. Not a problem. But we need to put in copper. And let's give it uh, some carbon. We don't need that much. We do, we do use chromatic metal a lot, so I will put it at about five. It won't take long to finish three minutes. Not that big of a deal. Like I said, um, you'll see that our other ship is no longer here. It is, well, yes it is, it's over there. I'm a dummy. What the hell is that? Okay. So you got fungal cluster, subterranean relic. You might go check that out. Buried technology module, ammonia deposit, jade peas, buried technology, silver deposit, silver deposit. That's the, our thing there. Buried tech. Oh. Very cache, JPs. What is this one right here? Let's salvage data. Let's look at our refinery. Still got a little bit more to go. Silver deposit again. That's the distress beacon we're at. Capital ship. Silver deposit. Subterranean relic. Let's go check that out. We got time. It's not going to hurt anything for us walking away for the moment. I'm thinking it might be done in this cave system here. Vortex cubes. Okay. Really need cobalt. What the hell is that? Oh, that's some more vortex cubes. Alright. Just because we need just grabbing a little bit more copper and oxygen. Copper. Carbon and oxygen. We have plenty of it. Them damn, I, them damn lights on that top of that moss, that creature's head scared the shit out of me for a moment. All right, let's see what we got. All right, that is now ready, and we needed to do some more processors. And we got to worry about the shields on this on this ship as well. Photon, um, we'll go ahead and do this one as well, because we more than likely will be using this ship. Uh, as one of our other standard ships, there's a lot of things that need to be replaced, but that's fine. We'll do that on the uh, freighter ship. <laughs> Let's see. Warp cell. I need antimatter and antimatter housing. Where's the antimatter housing? But I have oxygen and ferrite dust. All right. So oxygen and ferrite dust. Most of our ferrite dust on these last couple of videos have been coming from these little rocks and stuff that we find 
need to find a good spot for oxygen as well. All right, let's check it out. What is on the other side here? Sodium and ferrite dust in these rocks here. A couple of these little guys walking around with like little gnomes or something along those lines, I guess you can say. All right, we got time. We're going to go check out this um, damaged machinery. Plus, there's oxygen over there beside us as well. All right, weapon charge deplete. We need to go ahead and get that upgraded, or not upgraded, but refilled. Exosuit. Let's see. Oxygen. A little bit of sodium in there. So all that's good. What are we looking like right now? We have oxygen and carbon is not all that great. What the hell is that? Okay, processes dirt, it's a little bit different. Got to watch that, make sure we stay on top of that. What do we got down here? Sodium, let's go check out, grab this sodium real quick. There's plenty of hydrogen. And now I think we're okay on uh, hydrogen dioxide. There goes something flying overhead. Don't know, oh, there it is. That's a big ship there. Big sodium rich plants. That's carbon and oxygen. Grab those real quick. You hear that big dude right there walking around. Pure ferrite carbon on that one. Something else over here burning. So we do have another ship that we can add. I will probably, like I said, we'll just take it back to our capital ship. And from there we will take um, one of the other ships that we do have and go ahead and get rid of it scat um salvage it out because we really have a kind of the ships that i'm not necessarily wanting but just you know that are available they're kind of cool i like the designs some more damaged machinery and this looks like a big hit of oxygen over here nope that is carbon plus condensed carbon and we got oxygen right up here and right next to that's kind of what, well, we don't see it now, but it's already gone. Kind of what our ship will look like. It has a big wing on the side. What do we got here? This is a silver deposit. You know what? We're going to grab this silver because I think some of the things that are needing repairs on the new ship that we are getting, I know I've seen gold. Silver is probably one of the other necessities, I'm sure. Oh, we're not getting any more silver there. Let's check. I'm still saying that we got some here. Just not seeing it. Some against the wall that we're standing on. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all the silver that we're going to find right there. More sodium rich plant there that we just got a hold of. There's our ship. All right, so let's head over to our ship. All right, let's see what we got. All right, so we need the warp cell, which is antimatter housing. All right, so it gives us 25%. That should be more than enough to get us back. We do not have any kind of photons, uh, any way to shoot back. We need some sodium nitrate. Can we make sodium nitrate with our um, portable scanner or refinery. We got 12. I put that in there. You give me sodium nitrate. I don't want you to spend all of it. I'll just do that amount right there. That should give us enough to fix the few little things that are asking for sodium nitrate. So most of the other stuff is going to be like paraffinium, pungenum, gold, little things like that. A lot of this stuff we already have on on hand on our uh, freighter our capital ship so yeah this won't be nothing to get rid of and fix up but as you can see the damage potential has already went up shield strengths already went up everything kind of building off of our um, off of the repairs that we are doing so let's get the main engine going let's get up to the, to the stars we'll head to our capital ship and get this place where it needs to be I was a little bit further out in front of it than that. 
that sounded a little bit different coming in. All right, so there's one of our, uh, well, this is our new ship. And this is what I kind of want is get a couple of these newer ones. That way we can uh, do whatever we want to do or change a few things up if we want to. Now comes the time. Where the hell's my other ship at? It ain't got here yet, I'm, I'm assuming. Can I take this ship? Let's see. This is all that this is an authentic authenticated starship. This this joker here is pretty badass. So maybe we don't get rid of these. Maybe we just repair these little haulers here. Because they are class A's. Let me go. Let me go check it out. these little haulers right here could be worth fixing up if that's their abilities class a so do we get rid of our first ship then this little dude right back here radiant pillar bc1 this is a class c and it's got some stuff on it that we need to move around let's transfer to the suit to the suit I want to keep all that stuff, so I'm going to have to go up and get rid of a lot of the stuff that's on on our bodies. Well, shit. To empty that ship out. Alright, where is the exchange at? Too bad this exchange is not in, like in the cargo bay. It would be a lot simpler to uh, get rid of. Do -do 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 -do. Marable, we can sell. Starship doesn't have anything. Hard frame engine, I need to put that up. Oh, this is in the freighter. Okay, hold up. All right, let's see. Do we, what kind of space do we have open now? Three slots. All right, let's go put some of this stuff up in our um, storage. Here, sodium nitrate, support gel. We can move that over. Basium. Let's pull that one back out and I don't put those all over on the other side. Vec, uh, Vec effigy or Viking effigy. That's Viking G. <clears throat> Let's see. What do we got here? This is navigation data. Let's go ahead and pull that. Put it in our system here. Salvage data. It's a Corvette casing. Viking dagger. Let's put some of the, well, let's keep the Vortex Cube and Ancient Keys on us just in case we run upon something that requires those. We do have the extras on us. But yeah, this stuff right here is kind of the stuff I want to put over here. I think most of these are actually on the freighter, these effigies. Slot upgrade. Multi-tools. Okay, what is this thing? Cargo bulkhead and storage augmentation. I wonder if we can put this... Uh, you know, uh, on our uh, multi-tool then. Let's get that over here as well. We'll check that out real quick. Uh, space station multi. Okay. So we can't do it just yet. We have to actually take this with us to a space station that we're going to be going to here momentarily anyway. So we can um, get rid of some of these other ships. And let's see. That's one... Yeah, there it is. This is the one we're gonna to try to get rid of. I mean, it is a good ship. It is one. It is the first ship that we started with. Got us going. Transfer that over to the EXO. 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 Let's look at the freighter. What do we got all in the freighter? Uh, let's transfer that to EXO suit. These are definitely going in the EXO suit. All right, so these are some of the relics right here. We'll leave them where they're at. All right. So let's check out one more thing I want to look at, make sure. I'd like to see that both of our um, ships are here. That's the one with the wing. Don't see our other one just yet. Hopefully we don't. We can have at least six ships or so. But we're going to take this one here. Let me check um, my exosuit because I can't have too many things on me at one time. <laughs> and a lot of this stuff needs to go 
um into our storage. Damn it, I did it again. I don't know why this backside don't have a teleporter up. So now we're gonna head to the storage again. A few of these things to drop off. I went the wrong way. I went to the trade gal galaxy instead of the um instead of the other shit. I don't know what this green crap is around me. God damn it, I walked right by. All right, so let's move this stuff over here. Because we do have a lot of it. I don't know what all we're going to use it for. I can go back. We'll put the processors up. This can come over as well. Let's see. All right, so that should be enough room for that when we salvage this ship that we can... Um, have enough room to get all the materials off of it so it isn't our original i mean it isn't um ship that we found it is the original fighter type ship that we had to begin with but i am going to take it to the space station to see if we can scrap it out because with these other ones i don't really need it anymore i don't want us to lose the possibility of, of getting better ships and everything Hopefully that's not the case and we'll be able to sell this one off or salvage this one off to get more. I don't know that it is a limit on the ships that you can have, but you know we'll see see how it goes. Hopefully this doesn't mess us up when we salvage this ship out and we don't have a ship to get back to our freighter. Hopefully it'll put one here for us. Yep, we're going to begin salvage analysis. Scrap, it's worth 3.4. All right, so we are starting to get the components from that little ship. A couple C-class, as you can see there, compressed ideom, a few other things. A lot of this stuff can actually go back to the storage unit on the capital ship. So it's giving me one of my haulers to get back, which we'll go ahead and jump in. And hopefully when we get back into our capital ship, then we'll be able to get back into our normal ship that we have been using every day. Do have some new, looks like activated copper, phosphorus. Okay. And it is showing some capital ships that would like to be joining us or whatever right now i'm just trying to find my capital ship that seems to be lost in space some damn where there we go some of those newer ones look like they were smaller ships so kind of like support craft for our freighter that's uh, another thing that i will be looking into is to get a bigger freighter i do like the setup that we do have because it came with a a huge greenhouse already but i'm hoping that we can find others um, a little bit bigger a little bit more to it than what we are currently getting there's a big hauler leaving out let's see both of our ships should be here if not i screwed up and i shouldn't have been recording this and i am not seeing our other ship where in the hell is our other ship ah oh, what the shit, man hmm not cool was that other ship had a lot of stuff on it and a lot of uh, inventory space and everything. Primary starship is switched. And like I said, I don't know where the hell our other ship is. Hopefully we can get that back soon. I'm just spinning around, hoping that it'll come up when we go back in, I might actually have to uh, technically leave the game before it actually shows back up. Hopefully that's not the case, but I'm kind of thinking it might be. Our haulers are on this side. We are in bait two, as you can see, of course. But I'm not seeing our other ship any damn where. And that kind of bothers me. That's the only thing I don't like about grabbing these damn ships from planets like that is you don't know supposed to come back because all i did was just claim and i didn't abandon my other one so i don't know what the hell the issue is with this we will find out i'm gonna go ahead and get this stuff up to storage check and let's see if our fleet needs to go out on a mission or not let's look at the fleet real quick and see what they're they're still good uh, it's the freighter warp map upgrades and controls you need to move your ass out of my way let's see 
debrief. All right, let's find out what happened. They traveled 980 light years, collected bounty in local station. Okay, let's see what else they got. I uh, got a reward for units. Uh, some more units rewarded for destroying looks like bounties and debris. Collected Grand Time. Grand Time. Okay. All right. So they're back. Probably need to uh, go store some more stuff. Let's go ahead and put all these over here. This is the stuff that we just pulled off of the other ship when we uh, salvaged it out. Everything else looks okay to be staying where it's at, just so that we have them. And let's go ahead and check out, see if we can install Conflict Scanner. Uh, if I do, I will be putting that on my main ship, not one of these other ones. Let's check it out. See what they need. View potential expeditions. That's uh, 2,400 light years, almost 3,600 light years. That one is... Less than a thousand, about fifteen hundred. Let's go ahead and get the big one out here because I mean, big and as far as light years, that's a balanced expedition. This one here is a little bit better, but we'll do this one here first. Looks like they need more fuel. All right, can we get the little one out of the way then? Yeah, we've got the fuel to do that. So we'll go ahead and send them out on that mission. We'll have to get with our. Let's look at our freighter real quick because we'll need more fuel. Freighter fuel 200. Okay, we need uh, dihydrogen and tritium. We have enough for that. We'll go ahead and do that. Federal port coordinates. All right, so right now you see we're at 26.6 million in units. Almost 7,500 in nanites. Quicksilver, I haven't seen a use for that just yet. This is our current multi-tool. Burning Shock Puncher. This is our current starship that we are using. We got a lot of um, repairs that we need to be doing on it. Looks like we can get the majority of them done because everything is already on the freighter so that we'll be able to get a lot of this already taken care of. It's just going to pull it straight from the inventory that we have. And hopefully we'll start increasing the abilities of this ship in the long run don't have any more gold so we'll start jumping on these other ones i know we've got more gold somewhere platinum we need gold 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 chromatic metal we can take care of oxygen we'll need to take care of as well and of course more gold so we got most of the stuff uh fixed up straightened out already a few of them like i said platinum and gold is where we're looking at chromatic metal oxygen that is currently where we're standing at with those items that we'll need to uh, get to finish the repairs on this ship not sure about this damn green mist that's kind of like doing the outside of my uh, suit here toxin suppressor maybe but I'm not really sure on, on what the hell that is about probably something we picked up or something we did and they are wanting us to put in the conflict scanner here, but we do not have the walker brain to do so. This is some of the technologies that we can put in um, with this ship as well to boost it up. We'll do that because rockets are going to be an issue for this. But we'll go with that, and hopefully when we come back next time, our other ship will come in. We'll be here. So that everything is the way we wanted it and everything be good. But until then, we'll see you guys next time. Don't forget, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and ring that bell for notifications. And it's really pissing me off that I'm missing my other ship. Hopefully it does come back because this is not cool, bro. This is not cool. But see you guys next time.